Hey everyone, here's my review of the Bacardi Gold. The Bacardi Gold Rum. There's, uh, there's something overhead, so there may be some noise here. But so, typical Bacardi Rum. Now, I'm skeptical. Will anybody be searching for this? I just did a Glenn Farkless review, so... I just did that, and then I'm I'm like okay, let me toss another quick review and just some random thing I have inside my inside my my small bar, and I came upon the Bacardi Gold. Now this isn't the cheap Bacardi, but it's still cheap, right? Because it's Bacardi, so it's rum. Who's looking for a rum review? Nobody probably. Well, let's see. Um, should I tell you something about this rum? Let's do that. Let's treat it with the respect it deserves and give it the best chance, the best shot we can give, the best thing we could do for this rum. Let's open it up. Let's treat it the way we treat anything else. The way we tr we treat the Glenn Farkless 30 I just reviewed. Watch that episode if you're into something very premium and want the same format in a more sober and... a more sober way because I finished the 30 now drink responsibly that's very important too much alcohol can be bad for your health and bad for your wealth and shallow man cares about both drink responsibly don't be a fucking idiot okay so seriously I can go on a rant right now I'm about to go on a rant I'm tempted to how alcohol is poison this this is poison this is pure poison you shouldn't be drinking this stuff you should not be. And it's a waste of money. Especially the Glenn Farkless 30 I bought. And I just reviewed. Waste of money. This is more affordable. But still, this will lead you down a dark, dark, bad path. Avoid this stuff. Avoid it. But, if you're curious, I'll use my body as a guinea pig and I'll tell you how this stuff tastes. So, let's pour a tiny bit. Now, to give it the proper thing, we're going to let it air out as we'd... Let anything else air out. Just air. Let, let it absorb with the oxygen. So let's see the ABV. The ABV on this is 40. Here's the bottle. So Ron Superior Carta Oro. Uh, Bacardi Santiago de Cuba. Un Empresa de la Familia Bacardi. Made in Puerto Rico. Excellent. Excellent. Beautiful. Beautiful bottle. I like it. Cheap but beautiful. Cheap but beautiful. Okay, now let's check it out. Expertly crafted by Maestros, Deron Bacardi. Bacardi Gold is blended using rum aged between one week and two years in oak barrels, then shaped, then shaped through a secret blend of charcoals to craft a remarkable smooth and rum character. Wow, a remarkable smooth rum character. I didn't know this is aged. That's what gives it this tone. Imagine how a 10-year-old, a 20-year-old aged rum would be. Wow. That's cool. All right. Let's keep the bottle here while I drink it. Let's nose it first. Okay. Let's nose it. You immediately smell the alcohol. Not impressive. Right away you smell the alcohol. No complexity. Just an estrogen type, alcoholic type feeling. Okay. Let's taste it. I don't even know what to say. It's different than I expected. I haven't drank rum in a while. This has been this has been around for a while. I haven't drank it. This is um. I thought rum is supposed to be sweet. This is not sweet. First of all, astrogen type. 
but not nearly as as astringenty as I would have expected. The agent does give a little bit of a it does give a little something to it. It even has some tasting notes on the back here with notes of vanilla toasted almond and light oak. That's funny, funny stuff. Interesting. So, interesting. I don't know what to say. Not a Bacardi fan. I don't think I'm skilled enough to opine on this. But, yeah, that's what it is.